Hi, I'm the Prophet Oblong. I'm better in every conceivable way than the tiny penis, racist hate group member, fat fucking slob you are currently living with. Smarter, more attractive physically, funnier, penis more than twice his size and girth as reported. So much better at participating in sexual activities it isn't even in the same category. Your best friend, your equal, the blue-eyed boy next door that you told your family was your soulmate when you were 18 and I was 8. Your perfect counterpart, compassionate and loving, an infinite attention span, stimulating conversationalist. We don't have to modify our speech to communicate. You are the most intelligent person I have ever met. You are truly the sexiest woman to ever exist. Brown hair, hazel eyes, petite, looking up to kiss me. Please bring yourself the clothes you are wearing and a case of zip fizz. You know what's really awesome about this? I mean way fucking cool. That the pathetic, coward, narcissist, loser Thomas Wayne Randall, a man with a very tiny penis, can't complain or say anything. What's he gonna do, sue me? By all means, man, that would be ultra neato. Bring me free publicity. As it is, I've got to generate it all. Juggle and eat fire and balance balls on my nose. If he could just sue me, publicists would line up like ambulance chasers and ensure a nice, clean, high-def live camera on Patty as she reads her gospel on a witness stand and then leaves the courtroom with me. And we have a season of a reality show. She's photogenic for sure. I'm not horribly asymmetrical. And he's a genuine monster. He looks exactly like a picture of everything I'm accusing him of in a dictionary. She doesn't use certain words and I only use them. That's funny. And neither of us ever shut up. Someone else has got to edit that dialogue, man. That is not my job.